Hello YouTube, I'm your solution here and I'm back again in the video. Um, please check my previous videos out if you haven't already. I've covered lots of transfer news regarding Neymar, James Rodriguez, Marquinhos and I've also done a video showcasing Anthony Marshall's goals for Manchester United so please go check that out, it's on my channel. Um, I think I'll put the links down below for all the videos I've just mentioned. But anyways, let's get into this video. So as you can see here, Manchester United ready to seal transfer of £37 million Romelu Lukaku. So let's get straight into this. So... Manchester United manager Louis van Gaal has made no secret of his desire to sign big name striker in January transfer window, with Romelu Lukaku set to be a prime target. The Belgian has been lethal in form for the Everton this season, scoring 15 goals to fire him joint top of the Premier League scoring charts. United, by contrast, have struggled for goals due to inconsistent form from Wayne Rooney and Anthony Martial, and Dutch source The Telegraph claims that van Gaal wants Lukaku to fix this problem. So as you can see here, Lukaku has got 10 goals more than Anthony Martial, and uh, way more <laughs> than Wayne Rooney. So, obviously, he is a goal-scoring machine, and he's a great striker. So, the 22-year-old would most likely cost around £37 million, which seems a decent price to pay for a player who has shown much, such immense potential in his time in England so far. Lukaku started out at Chelsea before making his name with impressive loan stints at West Brom and later Everton, who he then joined permanently for £28 million in July 2014. So, who's been the best striker in the Premier League this season? And I pick Jamie Vardy, because he has, but... 47% chose Lukaku and 30% chose Vardy um, but Igalo and Harry Kane are obviously good strikers but I would put Igalo in front of Harry Kane at the moment because um, you know, he's from Watford and he's doing amazing at a, a team that's not obviously they just promoted and they're not what do you call it giants in the Premier League but um, the story is on Romelu Lukaku and I don't mind you know I don't mind if you sign Romelu Lukaku he's a great striker he's got strength pace, skill, um, obviously he's got shooting ability and he could be the uh, striker that solves our problem, you know, um, but I doubt, I don't know what will happen to Wayne Rooney, whether he will play centre mid, but if he does stay, play centre mid, will Schneiderlin get dropped and that's not good, um, will Schweinsteiger get dropped, will Anthony Marshall, will Mata, will Herrera, we just got so many options, um, if we do sign Lukaku, with it, there will be a lot of, you know, jumbling around with the team to get the perfect balance. But I do hope we sign at least two of the players that we've mentioned. Um, Felipe Anderson and Romelu Lukaku, they could be the players that could set a season up, you know, set a season and a title challenge. Um, I think we're, uh, I don't know, nine or seven points off first place. I don't think we're going to get first or second. I think we might get third or fourth. But you never know the season, how the season goes past. Hopefully we can kick on our, our win against Swansea. we just start winning games. If we do win three or four games in a row, we could potentially see ourselves in third or fourth place and uh, depending on how the Premier League goes but obviously the Premier League is inconsistent and I doubt that we're going to go on a three or four win game streak um, next up we got Sheffield United and I hopefully we, we beat them but you never know with United I think we're going to struggle I think we're going to only win around one or two nil but I do think we'll win so anyways please leave a like down below and subscribe if you haven't already um, we need 10 more subscribers to reach 300 subscribers and that's going to be a great achievement and um, hopefully you guys help me with that so I'll see you guys later.